Hello there, my beautiful legendaries, and welcome to another Let's Talk. I told you on my first Let's Talk, these guys are going to come in many different ways. If you see behind me, it's the TeamSpeak server. I'll talk about this for a couple seconds, and I'll move on to what I want to talk about. Alrighty? Okay. TeamSpeak server is not really fully public. I'm only letting certain people join. Um, that's all I can really tell about that. Mainly because it's my IP. If you if you guys go through the connection or through the server tab, or look it up through the server list, you will find it right there on that name, Cyberspace Online Geeks CSOG. You guys can find it that way if you guys want to join. But other than that. It is very limited. It's only 32 slots, I believe, and six of them are reserved for me and my friends. Um, Hopefully, to get you guys some more videos out, but for some reason, I have to use um, Skype whenever it comes to recording because TeamSpeak's not fully coming through on recordings. So it's really putting a big dent into what I want to do. <laughs> Just taking a sledgehammer and putting a big hammer to it. But I will apologize for my computer. I don't know why you can hear it. I don't know why this mic is so sensitive. I can barely hear my computer, but this mic will pick it up. Like it's a rat in the most quietest house in the world. Yeah. But anyhow, this video is letting you guys know of why is it only trying videos? Why? Well, the reason why is because I have quite a few of those, and that trying, the first trying series is actually almost over with. I have some behind the scenes and cutouts that I still have with that, but the trying to, mm, I, I'll go ahead and say it, the trying to may not get posted because, um, actually, yeah, it's not really a post because it's not finished with the person I started with, or well, with uh, Shots of Patron. Which, again, go down in the description, click her link, show her some love. Try to bring her back to YouTube. Show her the love of YouTube. Give her, even though she gets more views than me, but you guys know. You guys know how this works. I'm still small. I'm trying to help build her up, and but she still gets more views. It's the views, man. It's the views. I'm telling you. <laughs> but anyhow, um, yeah, just go to her channel, click that like, and try to bring her back so we can get that, get trying to either restarted or from where we left off when we, rest we started recording it um, but if we don't finish that then I'm not going to post it because that's like almost midway of being completed and it's either midway it's got one or three levels left on it not 100% sure it's been I want to say three months since we've worked on it the recordings you guys are seeing were maybe four months ago that we've done um, we completed the first trying and maybe the first week or first three nights, I don't remember. <laughs> um, so yeah, that, that basically explains why it's nothing but trying, well not fully explained, but any other game I try to record, like, I want to make a series out of it. I don't want it just to just be random videos out of nowhere, it's like, I want it to be a series leading, like, trying, I've got a full series of the first trying. I want to, if I do Minecraft, I want a series of it and a storyline, basically, to go with of why we're trying to do what we're doing. Grand Theft Auto is sort of difficult to do that with just because of it's always jumping around I'm always with somebody else playing the game. It's never the same person I'm playing with. So, like, trying is always with Shots of Patron and um, that's where it led into a better series because it's not always somebody changing. We are trying to get somebody else into the trying series with us just because that third character becomes sometimes a hassle for us to switch through constantly. Even though sometimes it's easier for us to switch to the character we're using if we get into the next level to switch to that character. Get up there, we switch, obviously that person can be the same character. They get twice as fast through it. If not, it takes us forever. But we can still able to switch that way. It just yeah. Um, but yeah, back to the series thing is, I don't want to have a different character or a different person 
and they're with me every time on the series. Well, the, the first couple uh, episodes of the series, I want the same person. And then we can later introduce somebody else, or if it's three people starting out, I want three people being the first couple videos. And after that, I would like for, like, if that person needs to get to do something the day I want to record, or we have planned to record, they have plans to come up, or something just happens, I can still make it happen because it would be like I could throw in the series this person is on vacation for so long and have like maybe four episodes come out for you guys and then lead on until they come back to bring them back from vacation and just record a bunch of videos with them that so it makes up for the four in case something else happens so I don't really cut out my videos I don't edit them mainly because I want the full raw footage being put out. A lot of YouTubers actually don't do raw footage anymore. And that's something I always look for the most. Every time I watched the first Minecraft video I ever watched was around 45 minutes to an hour long. And it was all raw footage of what was going on. And that was one of the things that started making me want to try to become a YouTuber and grow. And to show how much more you can get from a raw video than if you cut out like I'll try if I can I try to cut out like the most boring parts if I'm in the Minecraft and I'm mining cobblestone or digging up dirt I'm not going to let you guys sit through the um, pain and watching that so what I'm going to be doing is I will either speed it up I see you can see me go really fast or I will actually cut it out. That might be the only few things I cut out. Now, if there is a way for me to do one in GTA, Grand Theft Auto 5, I'm not talking about 4, fuck 4. Um, pardon my language, not really. Um, but if there's a way for me to do that, then there probably wouldn't be any speeding up because I have some of the fastest cars in the game. And it really takes me no time to get from one side to the other. It's just, I don't quite understand how I can make that into a full series or anything like that. Like, I know I could do something along with the um, job-wise, races. I could do things with that with friends. But I would like to try to keep the same people playing, which normally is the same people. It's just, some people just aren't as fun. They don't have the energy and some people have too much playback. That person will know who he is if he watches my video. Or she? Mainly he. Yeah, he. So yeah, um, that's where it's going to lead to that so far. I might be bringing American Trucking Simulators into the game. Don't hold me to it. Because I still haven't brought scrap mechanic into it for you guys yet. Um, I'm still learning the basics of the whole game scrap mechanics because every time I load the game, there's always something new added. So that's something else I already I gotta learn. I would take you guys on the experience with me of learning it, but it becomes so damn boring, like so fucking boring. Um, the only thing I know what to do is I'm probably copying part of a, another YouTube, um, Neves Gaming. They'll make build-offs, and they'll have an obstacle course. And they'll try to make a machine of some sort to complete the obstacle course that they have created out of random, just about. And that right there, to me, sounds like pretty the cool thing, really. I mean, it sounds fun to do with friends if I can get other friends to buy the fucking game, you cheap bastard. But I can't really say anything. I'm broke right now, so... Ah! And for those say that YouTubers, even at first starting, make a good amount, you're a fucking liar. You can rot in hell. Um, YouTube is a lot of work. I can say that for a fact. It is a lot of work. It's hard to create your schedule when you're first starting and you have another job on the side because you can't just quit your job out of nowhere and expect... Your insurance be paid for your car if you have car payments be paid for your bills be paid. That's not going to happen out of hopes and dreams that YouTube just all of a sudden takes off for you. 
you have to work a schedule inside of your work schedule and then you have to work on top of that and I see that's where Shotza comes in place of why well, she's not really uploading she has basically a full time job and she's going to be having schooling well she has schooling as well on top of having a life on the outside so it's making it makes it really hard to have a schedule for as I I'm going to be going back to school as well myself to become an electrician and on top of that to um, try to make a schedule in this somewhere if I ever have homework to have more videos that's what I'm trying to record in bulk that's how I can always give you guys something to watch of entertainment um, I have another mic I could be using but the audio sucks let's put it that way not not until I get a soundboard of some sort right now I'm using my headset when I stand I don't feel like putting it over my head because I fucking think it's just heavy sometimes and but anyhow the headset I use is Logitech G930 it's a wireless headset it's beautiful the battery life is outstanding I recommend it to anybody that's looking for a great wireless uh, headset I'm not sponsored which is bullshit I should be for as much Logitech shit I have or how many Logitech headsets I have went through but every headset I've ever had through them, it's lasted me more than four years, so I've got my money back through it. Um, the warranties are always up to three years, and I always outdo the warranty, so that's how great I love the headsets. Audio is great, everything, but anyhow, off that subject. I still need to do a review on my computer, my setup, everything, but I'm not going to do that until it is complete. There's a lot of modifications I want to do to my desk, and I also want to do to my computer still. Um, I guess I can make a quick video of just the computer, but my desk and the whole setup I will not do because I'm not satisfied with my desk. So, yeah. Plus, I don't have as many monitors as I want. I've only got two, and I need three. People will say, you don't need three. I want three. I don't need it. I want it. There is a different difference. So that ex me means me expanding my desk. I am a great handyman, let's put it that way. I can make my own damn desk. So I bought a pre-made desk from Walmart just to get me started. But now the time's coming, and whenever I get the money, I'm basically taking that whole desk out and putting, building my whole entire desk the way I want it to be, not just, you know. This is why this is a let's talk. Okay, I keep looking at my teeth because I this is fucking quite cool to be honest with you. First time I got that to work. Okay, we'll talk a little more about teeth speak than one on the video. Okay, as you see, I don't have the normal teeth speak layout. Mainly because I cannot stand bright lights being right in my eyes, you know. I have very sensitive eyes, so I have to be careful with the lights if not my eyes start to hurt really bad. Um, so I went with the Razer theme. They're actually really simple to install. Just go to TeamSpeak website, go to the add-ons, and from there you can pick themes. And it's just down the list. There's a couple of different Razer ones, but this is my favorite one just because it's got the blue. Oh, fucking camera. It's got the blue up there. Um, I also added a voice pack, uh, Duke Nukem. It's a really deep tone, and I can give you guys an example. It might be loud as fuck. Sound resume. Sound muted. Sound resume. Okay, that should give you guys an example of what it is. Ooh, I lost some color. The hell? Okay. But anyhow, with the TeamSpeak, here are my PC specs. I, I guess I can go ahead and read them off because next video might be PC review. I do love my PC. I love the setup of everything of it. So, but here we go. Specs. It's the NZXT Phantom case. That's it. That's its model. Um, the motherboard is the Z97 Gigabyte Gaming motherboard. Oh, it's the Gaming 5. It's on the lower end of the motherboards. Of that one. Uh, I have 32 gigs of RAM. 4 sticks. 16... Wait. Right? No. 8. 16. Yeah, 
eight eight gigs. Oh, fuck, long night. Uh, my CPU is an Intel Core i7 4790K at 4.0 gigahertz, the 1150 socket, which is going to make it sort of harder for me to find another motherboard to go with that CPU because I love this um, CPU that I have. It takes on anything, but if I try to run Vegas Pro, it sucks life out of it. I don't know why it shouldn't, but it does. Um, my GP, well, CPU cooler is the V8 GTS um, vapor chamber and eight heat sinks. Well, you guys will see that in a video, so I'll get in a little more detail with that. Um, let me see. My graphics card, they actually no longer make this uh, style of the one that I have. I've been trying to find another one so I can buy it, but it's so damn hard to find it. But it is the Sapphire uh, Vapor X. Radio on R9 280X 3 gigabytes DDR5 edition. Um, there's a few videos I've made of people reviewing it. I absolutely love the car just because it wasn't all that expensive and plus it pulls great quality. Um, my recording is basically all my fault because I'm still trying to learn how to set up OBS, but I'll go back to this and then we'll, like I said in the video. Um, I have one solid state drive, it's the Kingston 300 series, 2.5 inch, 240 gigs. Really not big enough for what I do. So I also have two other hard drives, a gig, well, one terabyte each. One of the hard drives are mainly for my Steam games, and that only. The SSD has Grand Theft Auto 5 and my OS on it for quicker boot time, since GTA is such a damn resource hog. I put it on there so it can boot and load faster and render the game a lot quicker. Um, I'm win running Windows 10 64-bit Pro. Uh, my keyboard is a TTE Sport Challenger Prime backlit gaming keyboard. Mouse is a 5500 DBI 7-button LED optical. Yes, I'm reading it right there as it is because I don't remember all of this. But yeah, it's on this computer. Oh, no, it's not all on oh, the computer. You guys know what the fuck I mean. Um, I have, I don't have, um, let's put it this way. I don't have computer monitors. I have TVs. For one, they're cheaper. And two, they're 32 inch. Vizio. They have great quality. I love it. The only thing that annoys the living hell out of me all around there is a little black border. I'm talking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's not gonna show up. About that big, that you see there, all the way around. Noise the fuck out of me. There's no way to remove it. I've tried every different way. Um, I think that's just the TV itself, though. But what can I say? There's 160 a piece, so I couldn't really beat the deal. Um. And again, my headset is a G930. That is my specs of my PC. They, I will go over them again whenever I make the video. Not sure how I'm going to make it, but I'm going to make it, and it will be done, and you guys will fucking love it. Oh. Okay, um, yeah. Okay, I'll end on this for sure. If, when you guys join, if you guys find this team speaking, you join it. There's my rules. They show up in the bottom of the chat. Read them, respect them, and you won't have any trouble being in the server. I do not deal with hackers. I will ban you immediately. I don't care if you have my IP. I can change it in a fucking heartbeat. So don't fuck with me. I am tired of these damn hackers. I'm tired of the bullshit. You come in here, you hack me. You're destroying yourself, really. That's all I can say. Plus, I don't run my teeth beak on my computer so yeah anyhow guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you have hit the like button if you have any ideas for me to create a series of some sort of any game that I might have I'll go over my games in some other video so if you guys have any games really that you like to see me play with friends or as a series Leave a comment below, 
share the video if you guys want like it dislike it you guys know where all those buttons are um but again be sure to check out shots patron let's try to show her some love to get her back into youtuber youtubing to get her spirit back high into this um i know she really enjoyed it so go show her some love guys thanks for watching again i hope you guys enjoyed man